Weasel News. What's up guys, Officer First 30 Minutes here. Today we are doing a Mount Chiliad patrol. As I promised, we are with the Los Santos Sheriff's Department patrolling in the 2015 Charger with a Sheriff skin on it. I'll leave a link for the skin if you're interested. I haven't patrolled much in the 2015 Charger and I wanted to take the opportunity to test it out some more. There's still kind of a bug with this middle brake light that I don't know if anyone's fixed it it seems to stay on all the time even uh, when you're driving so uh, we're just gonna take call outs do traffic whatever we want to do did I mention it is snowing a little bit today <laughs> we have some light snow in the area so uh, we definitely need to take that into consideration when we're patrolling it's a little slick out here uh, I, I, honestly, I don't even know if this is a roadway right here. I'm assuming it is. A lot of people mentioned to me last episode the Keep Calm mod was... Um, what the heck is this truck doing right here? The Keep Calm mod was glitching up the pursuits to make them go slower. So I, I, down, I uninstalled that mod. We don't have any more. Um, we got a random truck here in the middle of the road. Let's see if I can pull up to it and do a vehicle plate check on it. It's completely blocking the whole road. Plate check. Okay. Let's see what we get back on this. Doesn't seem to be damaged, but uh, we are blocking the whole road. Two, four, Tom, Ocean, Ida, Laura two, Anderson. One, seven, no, 1099. Okay, let's see if I can look up Laura Anderson. Sometimes I've been able to, sometimes not. We have a traffic alert in Mount Chiliad for possible terrorist activity. Nothing, okay. Nothing's coming back. Let's see if the vehicle is open. All right, looks like they left the vehicle unlocked. I'm just gonna do a quick search of it. Unfortunately with the snow mod, um, the inside textures of vehicles will get uh, snowed on, so that's why this whole inside of this car is snowed on. Nothing there. Let's see if we can check the back. I'm not sure if we can or not. Nope, can't check the back. We'll check the driver's side, see if anything's on it. If not, we'll just get it towed. Seems to have been abandoned for some reason. I'm not sure why. Okay, nothing there. So let's go ahead and call the tow truck up here. If we can get up here. We'll back our vehicle up a little so the tow truck can get to it. We've got a suspect resisting arrest. All right, perfect. I guess he's coming up this way. Please don't hit me. I will pull out of your way. There you go. Okay. All right, that was weird. Uh, I've never seen anything quite like that. A vehicle just obstructing traffic but we will continue our patrol okay we have a missing persons call I don't think I've ever gotten this last seen around Ranton Canyon Boyne County so let's go ahead and check this missing persons call out okay looks like they're off I think this might be a hiking trail I can't really tell in the snow I don't have the most off-road capable vehicle either. Next time we do this, we might want to use the police sand king or police bison. So I also wanted to say a lot of people um, ask me what plugins I'm using with LSPDFR. And I was thinking every month or so, I would make an update video showing which plugins I'm using and uh, just kind of how they work. 
so you guys know what I'm using because I'm using a lot of plugins and they can uh, kind of in interfere with each other uh, in a way so it sometimes causes the game to crash it might look like my game's pretty stable but uh, I will get crashes occasionally I just happen to cut them out and you don't see them so it is a lot of seeing what works and what doesn't work a lot of trial and error to get a setup that is somewhat stable I don't think you'll ever get anything with mods that's 100% stable so you got to see what mods work and what don't and cut out the ones that don't for the uh, sake of playing your game and that's what I do and it's been pretty effective wow this call is really long somebody somebody asked if I could change the um, distance on the map to the Imperial units I'm not sure how to do that it might be uh, options in the menu I just need to go explore but uh, honestly I have no idea how I'm sure it's an option though all right we're headed down like this side of the mountain here it's a little scary in this charger and we determined this call out was a code 2 call out and we determined code 2 oh bunny bunny we determined code 2 call outs were white and sirens through intersections so that's how we're playing it. I think it might also depend on the state or region you're in, what code 2 determines. But that is what we decided for the sake of my playthroughs. We had a lot of debate on the subject, whether or not um, code 2 meant uh, lights or no lights, sirens. But uh, I think this will work. And we're headed off the mountain now. Going headed on looks like US Route 1. Okay, let's just pull on here. Looks like people are stopping for me. Okay, we're headed southbound on US Route 1 for a missing persons call. This charger is so awesome. I don't think it came with the tier 6 LEDs, I just replaced them myself with the textures. And I I recently uploaded a tutorial how to install standalone police cars. I'm getting a lot of questions on it and I'll try to answer some of them. I just haven't had time to yet and it, it's really a case by case thing. Uh, everyone's not going to run into the same issues. can be very frustrating. I remember when I was trying to get it set up, I additionally or initially had the whole I think it was like 20 police car slots in my um, what is it the vehicles meta file and it kept crashing I was like why does this keep crashing on me well turns out because I had 19 other police cars the game couldn't find so uh, it could be minor things like that it just you know, like I'm saying it takes a lot of trial and error here 400 meters away So I guess I'm just searching for the person. What? A little race activity right there. <laughs> Don't let me see that, guys. Might have to break it up. So we have a green circle on our mini map. So let's go check this out. I'm just going to pull off the road here and walk over there. Okay. Let's see what's going on. My car should be saved. Hopefully it won't disappear on me. Okay, so we're looking for somebody who went missing in this area. Dispatch, I'm on the area code six. This is very appropriate for the mountain area. Wow, that is a super steep drop. We're gonna try to get down as carefully as we can. Oh my gosh, I tripped. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, really? That killed me. That really just killed me. Wow, I was trying to be careful too. I didn't, that looked like the easiest way to get down and my character just started tripping. I guess I hit my back on something. I don't know, I might have to restart my game now because every time I die, my game crashes. 
or not. Uh, I'm gonna head back to the area and I will be right back with Okay, you. we lost a little bit of time getting back here. I'm gonna have to find a way to get down here. It's dangerous when it's a missing person. Temperatures are cold. You got these uh, very high cliffs. Let's see if I can walk down here maybe. Oh my God. Okay. There we go. It's a little better now. We'll get down this way. Here we go. All right, perfect. There's a road down here, actually. Don't you trip and fall on me. Oh, we do have a car. Maybe this belongs to this missing person. Okay, this was the last area we've seen. Let's check out this car and see if anyone's in it. Car is empty. Can we plate check on foot? Yes, we can. We're gonna play check on that car, see if it comes back to anybody. Target license plate. Six, seven, Frank, Ocean, John, Esteban, Alvarez. No, Let's check the water too. We definitely need to find this person before nighttime hits. Otherwise, they're going to be in a lot of trouble. Temperatures will get very cold. Not seeing any bodies floating in the water, which is a good sign. Okay. So maybe they're on. We're going to have to go back up the mountain and see if we can see anything else. I'm not seeing anybody down here. Get back up the mountain if we can. There you go. At least it stopped snowing. Oh, I do see somebody straight ahead of me on a little cliff. That might be our person. Let's see if we can get over to him. Yeah, I think that's the person we're looking for. Oh my gosh, I just almost fell down the mountain. Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. There they are right there. Let's see if we can get over to them safely. Oh gosh. How the heck did you get right there? Oh no, stop. Stop. Get up. Get up. Okay, dispatch found missing person making contact. Roger, proceed. Okay, let's go ahead and talk to her. How you doing today, ma'am? You are you all right? Dispatch missing person is call is code four. Okay, I guess I don't. Hey there, sweetheart. She got lost here. Now she's calling. She had a cell phone the entire time, really. I finally got one of those phones that shows the number of who's calling. We have a traffic wow. in Rat Town Canyon. You know I don't like it. <laughs> she had a cell phone the entire time. I don't know. Maybe she had some personal issues she was dealing with. Just need to get away. Family was concerned. Called in a missing person report, and bam, we found her right there. So let's head back on patrol here. So now we're in Rainton Canyon. I think that's how you say it. It's right across. There's Mount Chiliad over there. So we'll stay in this area too. I mean, it's all Mount Police impersonator. Oh, I gotta take this call. I've never seen this call. I forget what. This might be the Code Three callouts pack. I'm not sure, but we got a police impersonator. We're gonna go ahead and investigate this. Respond Code Three. Lights and sirens. It looks like they're straight up ahead. We're on Cassidy Trail, headed southbound. Let's see what's going on here. Okay, we got a stop vehicle. Press Y to talk to the 911 caller. Okay, so this was the actual person who called in the police impersonator. Let's go 
ahead and talk. Oh, geez, officer, I'm glad to see you. This car came up behind me and flashed red and blue lights. I thought it was the cops, so naturally I pulled over. Guy gets out, walks up, and pulls out a gun. He took my wallet, my credit cards, everything. I was so scared, I thought he was going to kill me. But yeah, about his car, it definitely wasn't a police car, but it sure as hell was dressed up to look like one. It's a model that you guys drive, I think. The car was a graphite-colored Granger. Last three digits of the license plate were 343. Okay, victim's leaving the scene. I think this guy passed me. Headed the other way, I saw a, uh, a graphite-colored Ranger. So let's turn on the lights and siren and uh, head before he gets out on the interstate. It's only a one-way road, so I think we should catch him pretty fast. Yeah, red and blue lights on him. Okay, he's had it. He's had it towards the interstate. Ooh, you gotta be careful. Also, I was thinking about doing a LSPD FR shirt giveaway. I just bought. Here he is. He's right here. All right, suspect heard your siren and is fleeing. We got a suspect fleeing. Calling two local patrol units. He is fleeing. All right, what I was saying, I bought a LCPDFR and LSPDFR shirt to kind of support the the mod developers because they do all this for absolutely nothing, just add revenue on their webs. Oh my god, we got somebody down. All right, I called the corner. Oh my gosh, that car just completely got in front of me. My car is super damaged. Uh, I think one of my rims is gone. Something's grinding on the road. Okay. We're going to have to pull over and uh, get my car towed. It's just not safe to continue on this pursuit. Hopefully backup will stay on them. We'll call air support in. Alright, I'm getting my car towed. It's going back to dispatch. I'm gonna just go ahead and spawn another one. But that car, he can't, she came out of nowhere and just ran into me. All right, so that one's getting towed off. Got a new one. We really need a some type of plug-in mod that lets you call. All right, we got a, <laughs> we got a plug-in crashing on me. More control five crashes a lot. We really need some type of plug-in that. Um, you can call a new police car in. Okay, back to what I was saying. I got a LCPDFR and LSPDFR shirt to support the mod development team. And I was thinking about getting another one and doing a, a t-shirt giveaway through my Facebook page. So if you guys would be interested in some type of giveaway, let me know. Uh, I'd love to do one. They're pretty awesome shirts. They're just cotton shirts black shirts with LSPDFR logo on them but yeah I just wanted to show my support I've spent so many hours into this mod and the fact that they do it for nothing is absolutely amazing I've I've played this mod more than I have story mode so uh, I just wanted to show a little support I think I bought the t-shirts when the website was doing like a donation mode or something so hopefully it most of that revenue will get back to them. And we are gonna try to catch up to this pursuit. They're so far ahead of us, it's snowing out, it's a little slick. I don't trust people driving while wow, they're really far ahead of us. Let's get um, state patrol units as well. We're just gonna stay in the median. Had it southbound on US Route 1. Dispatch, we just chased this clown off the freeway. Okay, looks like they're off uh, US Route 1 now. I can't wait till we get a police SUV into the game, like a real life model, Ford Explorer or Tahoe. That would be sweet. That's really what we're missing now. I've seen that BX Bugs has gotten in 
and like a 2010 Impala into the game but um, he's not releasing it yet. There's some issue with Z Modeler. You can't lock your models, which I think just means people can't rip them off if they want it to. So he's waiting on some some way to, to lock the models. How do we need to get over here? We're gonna call in a police blockade, actually. Hopefully that works. Yes, I'm needing a, a blockade. All right, guys, excuse me. We're all the way in Del Perro Beach now. Suspect is heading west, do you copy? Okay. <laughs> We're almost out of uh, Los Santos or Blaine County District jurisdiction. Man, I cannot talk today, I apologize. Yeah, this is getting dangerous. We're headed through intersections. I see the police helicopter. This pursuit has gone on for quite a while. He's headed back my way, actually. Okay, we're gonna try to block. Okay. Just. Am I locked out of my own car? Oh no. Oh no, I am locked out of my own vehicle. Somehow when more control V crashed, it walked me out of the vehicle. How embarrassing. Okay. He's headed my way. Actually. He's doing circles now. So maybe if I stay at this, um, Maybe if I stay around here and just wait for him. Okay, now he's going a different way. We'll spawn a car again if he if he starts heading off. Yeah, okay. We're gonna spawn another car. I hate spawning a car, it's just so unrealistic. But we got to. Somehow I got walked out of it. Alright. Watch out man. Okay, oh he, he went off to a dead end. We got him surrounded here. He is surrounded. You ain't going nowhere, buddy. We got like four or five cops on him. Okay, he's running over officers. I'm taking shots. All right, he's down. Suspect is down. Police impersonator call is code four. Wow. What a chase. That was awesome. We'll go ahead and search his car, see if he had any equipment in here he wasn't supposed to have. Apparently he did have red and blue lights on the vehicle. What an awesome call out. We'll pull him out. And let's get the coroner out here. Go ahead and continue my search of the vehicle. He, is that ice I'm hearing actually? That is awesome. Check the trunk. Oh gosh. Forged ID cards. Maybe that was uh, like a fake police badge or something. Jesus. Oh, my heart. Okay, nothing. So let's run a plate check and then we'll just get it towed. I'm curious to see if it was, if it had anything else on it. Out of the, way, moron. <laughs> the coroner and this uh, sheriff have gotten locked. Two, one, Frank, David, 24. David, three. Again. Kim Richardson was a registered owner. That was not who was driving it. Okay, we'll get it towed off here. All right, I'll get out of your way. You probably shouldn't be driving that car, but um, yeah. Okay, tow truck is coming. You asshole. All right, awesome. Well, I think that's gonna wrap up this. <laughs> Mountain Patrol is what I'm going to call it. 
I hope you guys enjoyed. This Mount Chiliad was a very suggested patrol area. So if you have one that you've been dying to see, let me know. Uh, I'm going to be using new police cars as they come out. Thanks guys for all the love recently. I've been getting a crazy amount of subscribers coming to the channel. I'm glad you guys are enjoying the content. I just have so much fun making it. Something I get to look forward to doing every day. And thanks guys for coming on, coming with me on the journey. Well, I'll see you on the next patrol.